what is up ladies and gentle dudes kickers of the world and punchers of things i am with the fam for thanksgiving stuff i got this in the mail yesterday i don't know if you can see that i'm super pumped about it i got the t3 boxing gloves they were cool enough to send these to me uh, I won like an Instagram thing. I, I'm just super stoked about it, to be honest. Uh, they do like giveaways every month. So if you don't follow them on Instagram, you should because they give away cool stuff like this. So what I'm going to do right now is I'm going to give you guys like a brief preview. I've already opened these. I'm not going to lie. So sorry. But I'm going to give you like my first thoughts on them. And then I'm going to test them out in the gym. We'll go over like how they actually like the functionality of them and how I feel about them. But for like just looks, we're going to do that here. I'm at this like I'm at the lake. So I figured I'd have some cool scenery, so it's not just like me rambling about gloves. But, I mean, if you're not hyped about these gloves like I am, then I don't know. Oh, my gosh. <laughs> and take number two. Let's try this again. Okay, so hopefully I don't fall down again. Uh, right off the bat, built-in wrist support, custom fit closure system, a high impact hand protection, antibacterial lining, because my hands usually smell terrible by the end of it. I don't know if you guys have seen my, I'll show you guys my other gloves and what they look like as like a, once I get into the gym, which will be like the next part. But dude, they are, they are in bad shape. High end durable materials and then it's handcrafted. Here's the glove. I love the design and logo of it. So I'm like a very simple, sleek kind of guy. Like there's a lot of gloves out there that are really flashy. I like the really clean design. I love this little logo here. Anyway, and then I've, they've got the Hayabusa here. So uh, right off the bat, the first thing I noticed, cheapers. Okay, so the first thing I noticed is when you put these wraps on or these gloves, I personally don't wear wraps almost ever. So I don't really like worry about wrist support too much. But these are sick because as you can see here, you've got like two halves of this glove, right? When you put it your hand in, you've got this side and this side. What you can do is you can tighten both sides now. So this one, you pull up, you tighten, it pulls this here. And this one obviously pulls this side around and you still get like this really nice look to it. Oh, it's so pretty. So I'm terrible for like wiping sweat like this and usually it just pushes it more in. This right here is cloth rather than like this leather stuff they have up top. So you can wipe your sweat. I don't know how much it's gonna like coat this cloth or how much is gonna soak, so I probably won't do it too much. I don't know, I'll have to like test it out for myself later. All right, now if you've seen my intro, you know that scene, I get asked about that clip all the time. So we're gonna test out to make sure if these are like tree worthy, they feel really solid so far. <laughs> There's no way that I'm punching a tree with these things on. Okay, so we are back in the gym. Um, I have given it a couple days. I haven't gotten a chance to play with them yet because, you know, holidays and eating and stuff. So I've got like 17 extra pounds on me. I'm usually a teeth putter on her. I know a lot of people think it's gross, whatever. Yeah, so I mean like these are already feel like really sturdy. So we're going to test it out. We're going to feel how it feels on the bag. I still got the tags on. <laughs> Look at that, got them incisors. Hey. Like a wild lamb. All right, so. The wrist support, you can really tell it's there compared to like other gloves. Um, I mean, it's like I mentioned, it's got this back. I'm trying to pull my wrist back. As you can see, it doesn't, it doesn't budge. Uh, no, it feels good. Uh, the wrist feels great. Again, like, I just want to go over this. Look how pretty that is. It's just so solid. Wow. Magnifique! So I just finished hitting a heavier bag with these. I don't know what the size of that is, but a really solid, thick bag. They feel great. I, I'm like happier with them now than I was before, now that I can like actually hit stuff hard. I did not wear wraps. So the video that you saw, I didn't wear wraps. That being said, this is not enough to not wear wraps. So I would recommend wearing wraps if you're gonna go like all out on a bag. And I don't think that's what they're trying to portray either. I think they just want that extra wrist protection. They're not trying to say, 
you can have these protecting your wrist alone. I'm the only person who said that I don't wear wraps. They at no point said don't wear wraps. Let me show you my other gloves. Uh, I mean, they're, they're fine gloves, but they're like, I bought them at Target. And then the inside of them, I don't know if you can see in there, is like destroyed. You should see the other one, hold on. It's demolished. <laughs> like I can pull stuff out of there that you didn't know was inside of a boxing glove. Um, looks like 90s, like underneath the carpet stuff, you know what I mean? <laughs> and the reason that I bring up another pair of gloves in a review of these gloves, right, is because if you're buying gloves or you're looking to buy gloves, you've got like two different ways you can do it. You can go to buy a lower means pair of gloves, which is totally fine. I've been there. I'm there right now. I got lucky enough that they sent me these, right? They're not going to last you as long. They're going to smell. They're going to break down a lot quicker. You're not going to get the same support. Then you've got these gloves where like they're more expensive gloves but they're gonna last you so much longer and they're gonna be worth it. So if you have the means, I would recommend buying these. If you don't have the means, I understand, keep doing your thing. Super superior, they feel great. I'm gonna try something next. So like they feel great on your hands. Now I wanna know what it feels like on the opposite side. So we're gonna pause this real quick. Okay, yeah, you're fine. Okay. okay, so I'm just gonna let Forrest punch me in the head with these. I didn't warn him about this. Yes, just, you were really eager to take those. <laughs> He's like, yeah, punch me in the head, that's fine. Gross. <laughs> okay, so he's gonna punch me like, I don't know. Forrest has done some, like, boxing-esque training. Like, we've worked together a little bit. Forrest has been my friend since, I, I have no idea how long. It's, it's been a long time. So, he's gonna punch me in the head just because I want to know what it feels like on the receiving end before I punch other people, because justice, pre-justice. Okay. <laughs> okay, ready? All right, go. All right. That feels pretty good. I feel like that. Body shots too. Uh, okay, yeah, let's do, let's do some body shots. That's fair. Okay, that's good. No, th those were good. I like those. I, I feel confident punching somebody in the head and those and not feeling like a jerk afterwards. <laughs> I didn't like feel any knuckle. They're on the higher end price. I think they're like 140, but I mean, in my opinion, they're worth it. If I had like 140 to drop on gloves, I would buy these gloves. So like I mentioned, I mean, they're just, they're beautiful gloves to look at. Then they're handmade, which is awesome. They're not just like mass produced and shipped. I like the gloves, just me. I mean, they look good, they feel good, good wrist support. They smell nice for now. Oh, and they're supposed to have like this new inside of the glove thing that keeps them from smelling bad. So they don't look like my other gloves. Uh, so we're gonna cut back to whether or not I have a conversation with Hayabusa and they decide they wanna give me a promo code or not. Cause if they do, you're gonna see it in the clip right after this. And if they don't, that's okay. They're still good gloves if you wanna buy them. <gasps> oh, this could be hard.